All right, let's kill this bitch, guys. Let's do it. Let's do it. Yes, that's God. What is she doing though? Whoa! Take this, God! Ouch, jeez! How much health items do I have again? Oh no, we only have five. We don't have any more submachine gun ammo. Oh no. She's gonna do the same attack again. Ouch! Jeez. I supposed to dodge that? Oh man, we ran out of shotgun ammo. Oh man, she did lots of damage. how much health she has. I completely forgot how long it takes to kill this thing. Three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh no, we're running out of ammo. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And that's all of our ammo. Now I don't know how we can kill this thing. Maybe with a katana? Oh, that did it. At the end, just send to roll the credits. Still alive. What the? What have you? Oh. Oh. <laughs> Just a joke. <laughs> You've got terrible taste. I'm sorry. <laughs> Heather, did you? You don't have to call me that. I'm not hiding anymore. You want me to use your real name? What was it again? Cheryl, the name my father gave me. You're gonna let your hair color go back too? I don't know. Don't you think blondes have more fun? Okay, so that's the end of it, and yeah, it seems that we got the good ending as well. Yeah, we did get the good ending. Um, okay.
I can level normal, yes, normal. And we finished the game in 4 hours and almost 20 minutes. Okay. Split worm. Oh, so that's what it's called. The the PP the PP boss fight. Looks like a, a huge PP. So that's what I want to call it. Instead of split worm. It looks like a, an uncircumcised or semi-circumcised PP. And the missionary. Isn't that like a, a sex position or what? Missionary. Yeah, Leonard. Also, oh, the missionary is the one that killed Harry Mason. Leonard, uh, the weird guy, calling us in the on the telephone. And the memory of Alessa. Right, right. The god. Okay, so there are actually one, two, three, four, five, five boss fights. So this is our first uh, clear number. Well, I already finished this game a lot, so in a different platform. So yeah, uh, saves item number. Wow, we collected lots of. We actually completed lots of stars for the item number collection. Defeated enemy by shooting. What really? Total damage. Yeah, not bad. Okay. Extra new game has been added to start screen. Yeah, whatever, man. Play from there to see and enjoy extra features. Okay, so we can now get the hidden weapon, which is the flame thrower. Maybe at the mall. The one that I was talking about back uh, back in a couple of episodes. It's where you can easily miss the the item, the hidden item, or weapon, hidden weapon. And yeah, we also fulfill the conditions for the hit for the unlimited submachine gun. And of course, yeah, the extra costume. Happy birthday. Okay. So that's the password. Yes. All right. Uh, let's try the happy where's the letter P wow this looks like the typewriter in Resident Evil in the Resident Evil games or is it just me happy birthday There you go. The Heather shirt. Can we like... Can we like try that yet? Can we like try that... That outfit? Oh, there it is. That's our reward. The Heather outfit. Yep, there it is. Nice. Looking slick and fresh. Very nice. Very nice. Do we have the infinite submachine gun as well? Heather shirt, Silent Hill 3 original. Nice. But yeah. Wow. I really enjoyed playing this game again. It's 
kind of surprising that I dis I still discover more things again that I didn't notice before even though I've already played this countless times already so yeah that completes the continuation of Silent Hill 1 and Silent Hill Origins which are the prequel for this game so Silent Hill 1 is set 17 years ago and uh, fr from the events of this game and as for Silent Hill Origins I'm not so sure but it is the prequel or supposedly prequel for Silent Hill 1 but most of the fans doesn't consider Origins as a direct canon to the franchise because it is made by the western developers and there are actually some uh, plot holes or uh, aspects or features or um, stories in Silent Hill Origins that doesn't fit the universe or do doesn't make sense for Silent Hill 1 but yeah that that completes the saga of uh, Heather or Alessa or Cheryl well they're all they're all just the same person anyway so whichever name you like to call her but I think she prefers to call to be called Cheryl after Silent Hill 3 and yeah I hope you enjoyed as well because I definitely did and if you haven't watched Silent Hill Origins and Silent Hill 1 yet uh, you can check my this YouTube channel's playlist to understand more about the origin of the other world and the history of all this shit hitting the fan well yeah um, I'm not so sure if I'm going to play Silent Hill 2 and Silent Hill 4 again and make a commentary for them but yeah maybe in the future uh, maybe if I got the time but right now uh, I want to focus on other games uh, I'm not so sure what the next game will be what the next series will be for my youtube channel but I think it's gonna be uh, Cry of Fear or maybe I'm going to um, live stream it on this youtube channel so uh, I, I'm still undecided on that one and yeah well uh, that's everything for Silent Hill 3 thank you for watching so see you on the next series goodbye goodbye